Wall Street ended lower on Friday as Apple dragged down the major indexes. Apple said its iPhone 6 and 6 Plus were still available for sale in China after Beijing's intellectual property regulators barred sales, saying the designs had infringed on a Chinese company's patent. For the week, the major indexes were all in the red on continued concerns about next week's referendum on Britain's European Union membership. Kevin Kelly of Recon Capital. One of the biggest consequences that could affect the U.S. economy over here is that the do dollar would get significantly stronger against the pound, and that's the least that the large multinational corporations want to deal with. There's also a big problem with the banking system because the, a lot of U.S. corporations use it as a conduit into continental Europe. One boost to the S&P 500 on Friday was Oracle stock rising a day after reporting falling revenue, but it beat expectations. Housing starts slipped in May, but gains in building permits signaled a rebound in economic growth in the second quarter. In Europe, stocks moved higher as financial shares bounced back.